Right now, only on CBS 46, an incredibly close call for a Buckhead family. A man survives after being pinned by a tree that nearly split a home in two during this weekend's winter storm. CBS 46 is Adam Murphy live in Buckhead tonight with this shocking story. Adam. Well, good evening. The homeowner told me in an exclusive interview that she has some friends living in a guest house here in her home in Buckhead where that blue tarp is now when a tree fell on it early Monday morning. And I want to show you this direction. Look at all of the debris that the tree took out from that guest house. It's everywhere. Clearly a lot of work left to be done to clean up. Beneath all the debris and rubble, there's a story about the miracle on Old Ivy. My friend who's in the hospital keeps telling me it's not your fault. The Buckhead homeowner said a family of three was living in her guest house when a large oak tree fell on top of it early Monday morning during the winter storm. I have friends staying with me. And fortunately, um, the baby and his wife were in one room and unfortunately, um, the husband was in the other. The tree sliced part of the home in two, shaking the foundation like an earthquake and injuring the father in the guest house. Within maybe an hour and a half, uh, the firefighters were here. They got hydraulics and they pushed the tree off him and were able to get him in the ambulance. On Tuesday, all tree services cleaned up thousands of pounds of debris. The tree service said the large oak was healthy but simply uprooted due to high winds and saturation. It's not always uh, that the tree's unhealthy if it just catches the wind and, and the ground is saturated enough, obviously they can come over. Workers also put a tarp over the area of the home that was damaged until repairs can be made. Uh, I definitely think God was looking out for somebody that night. Uh, the tree came right down on top of the person and where that room was at is gone. Everyone is fine now. Um, and he's getting treated um, well, and uh, we expect a full recovery. And the homeowner told me that that man that is recovering sustained some broken bones, but will recover. And look at the car here. This is the homeowner's car that was parked in the garage just underneath that guest house. Quite a bit of damage here to the back of that car as well. So everybody here just counting their blessings this evening. We're live in Buckhead, Adam Murphy, CBS 46 News.